My husband locked me in the back to hide my 220 pounds. Instead of knee surgery, my husband secretly got lipo. He lost 70 pounds, splurging all our money on a new look. Instead of helping with our three kids, Ted started sneaking off to the gym. He banned me from his office. I now embarrassed him. On my birthday, he gave me an ultimatum. Weight loss or divorce? I cared about our family, so I went on a diet. Ted took my car, so I lose weight by moving on foot with all the kids' gear. I injured my leg from fatigue, but I didn't go to the doctor. Ted wouldn't give me a penny. He called it nothing but a bruise. By Ted's office party, I lost 15 pounds, dressed up, and hired a sitter. But Ted said it was canceled, and he had a meeting. I was halfway there, so I decided to treat myself anyway. Boy, was I in for a surprise. The party was in full swing. Ted was introducing his beautiful wife to his coworkers. When he saw me, he called me the sitter and dragged me to the back. He said he hired a model to maintain his cool image. Ted wanted me out. He was promoted and didn't need a scandal. I refused, and Ted locked me in the back room. I felt feverish. My injured leg turned blue. I blacked out. I woke up in the hospital minus a leg. Doc said I had toxic shock syndrome. They couldn't save my leg. I was unconscious for too long. Ted felt no remorse, demanding divorce that very day. A big boss like him didn't need a chubby, one-legged wife. Ted offered alimony if I kept our marriage a secret. How was I to cope with three kids now? I found a way out. Doc suggested I become a tester. His company created a prosthesis for three XL patients. I was the first. My single leg inspired people like me. Then Ted showed up again. He said he figured out how to make money even on a hop-along fatty. He offered me to advertise their company's sporting goods. The company wanted to attract new customers with body positivity. I agreed and waited for the joint press conference. There, I told how I lost my leg, calling Ted by name. Ted was fired immediately. Now he's job hunting and stress eating. He regained weight while I fell in love and started losing weight. Those who betray you over your waist size aren't worth a dime. Agreed?